Officials in Japan tonight are piecing together the tragic chain of events that left two planes on a collision course, ending in a fiery and deadly impact on a runway at Tokyo's Haneda Airport. Surveillance cameras captured the moment of disaster as a Japan Airlines Airbus with 379 people on board collided with a much smaller Japanese Coast Guard plane that for some reason was on the same runway, officials say was assigned to the arriving jet. After the impact, the passenger jet continued down the runway, leading a trail of fire. But remarkably, everyone on board the wide-body jet survived and safely evacuated. Tragically, five people on board the Coast Guard plane were killed. A pilot was the only survivor. The Coast Guard crew was responding to an earthquake disaster when disaster struck on the runway. Tom Costello has late developments. Fire and terror on the runway in Tokyo as a fully loaded Japan Airlines passenger plane arriving on a domestic flight crashed into a smaller Japanese Coast Guard plane. The massive fireball rolling down the runway. Airport is closed. Airport is closed. Inside the JAL plane, terrified passengers saw flames outside their windows, smoke rolling through the cabin. Swedish tourist Anton Deva was on board with his family. I looked to the left and I see flames all over the windows and the plane starts to shake and all the lights uh, turn dark and everyone starts screaming in Japanese. Once stopped, passengers evacuated down two emergency chutes. As airport firefighters attacked the flames, the plane's tail collapsed to the ground. Exactly the kind of worst case runway incursion the NTSB has warned about in the U.S. after so many close calls in 2023. The crash happened on runway 34 right, precisely where the JEL Airbus A350 had been cleared to land. The question for Japanese investigators, why was that smaller Coast Guard plane on the same runway, possibly preparing for takeoff? Of the six Coast Guard crew members on an earthquake relief mission, only the captain survived, now in critical condition. But all 379 people on board the passenger plane survived, including eight infants, precisely what flight crews in the U.S. and abroad trained for. Regardless of the size of the aircraft, the FAA requires that within 15 seconds of the aircraft stopping for an accident, it must be able to start evacuating everybody out through the windows, through the doors in just 90 seconds. That FAA rule is the global standard. Get up, get out, leave everything! Critical to surviving, leaving everything behind and getting out. When an American Airlines plane caught fire in Chicago in 2016, some passengers still grabbed their carry-ons. When passengers do not follow the instructions and do not leave their belongings in the airplane, they're not only putting themselves at risk, they're putting others at risk because of their blocking exits. In Tokyo, tragedy, but survival on the runway. And Tom, another grim reminder of why we need to listen to those safety announcements. I understand Japanese investigators will be joined by French investigators looking into why this happened. Yeah, that's right. Because it's an Airbus jet, the French team will be assisting. They're going to look at whether there was a communication breakdown between the tower and the Coast Guard plane and whether the passenger jet pilots could even see the smaller plane on the runway, Lester. All right, Tom Costello, thank you.